Hi everyone, welcome to Physics Lab and today we will gonna discover about how to measure a force. Here we already have a newton meter that will help us to measure a force of an object. Besides a force, we also can measure the mass of an object by using this newton meter. Now let's discover the force and also the mass of this coin and also we are using the mass hanger and let's check it out to start the experiment we will hang the force meter to the stand and read that the scale of the force meter is zero then we will put the mass hanger to the hook of the force meter and i will tell you how the force meter works so actually there is a spring inside of force meter the pulling force will stretch the spring and this moves the indicator along the scale so the bigger the force the further the indicator moves so now i put the coin one by one to the mass hanger and you can check from the spring it will stretch and also it will goes down because of the gravitational force As the mass increase, the gravitational force will increase as well. We already put all mass to the mass hanger and yes, we can check the scale of the force meter right now. Okay, now can you guess the mass and also the force of this coin? Yes, the mass is 150 grams and the force is 1.5 newton. Very good. Now, I will give you another object and you have to find out the mass and also the force of this object.
Alright, so have you found the force and the mass of some objects there? Okay, let's check some summary for today's experiment. So another name for a force meter is a newton meter. We also call this as a spring balance. The spring balance works on the principle that a bigger force will stretch the spring to a bigger extent. In Indonesia, we call the spring balance as neraca pegas. The spring balance is a direct reading type of weighing instrument. Last but not least, the gravitational pull on the object will cause the spring balance to be stretched by a distance proportional to the weight of the object. Okay, so that's all for today's experiment. I hope you enjoy the activity and see you on the next video. Bye everyone!